Overwatch 2 has finally released and with it being one of the most highly anticipated video game launches in quite some time, there are a lot of people logging on to play this game. According to Gameper.com, over 10 million people have already logged on to Overwatch 2 within the first couple days, with daily average player counts around 900,000 to 1 million players. So far in the couple games that I've played, I've enjoyed the Overwatch 2 gameplay, however, most of my time with the application open looks like this. For those of you who have been trying to play Overwatch 2 the last couple days, I'm sure you've ran into these long queues. If you haven't, you've been one of the lucky ones who's been fortunate enough to play the game majority of the time. However, most of us have been waiting in these long queues, and for players like myself who don't play Overwatch all that often, maybe it's not their main game. I play Call of Duty majority of the time, but I definitely am intrigued to Overwatch, and I do like playing the game. But waiting in these long queues for hours on end is definitely alarming for the Overwatch community and for the developers, because a lot of newer players or players return to the game are going to get frustrated by waiting in these queues and might have a tendency to move on to newer games or games that they've played in the past just because they don't want to wait for server errors and server crashes and stuff like that. Now I will note Activision Blizzard has been the victim of a couple DDoS attacks so I can't blame them for that. However, if these server errors and long queues continue for the next couple days and even weeks, they could lose out on a large majority of their player counts. In a game that has almost a million players playing it, 100 to 200,000 players could mean a lot of money for Activision Blizzard. Not only that, but that adds to the player count and adds to the skill-based matchmaking and allows for a better player experience across the board. So it would definitely be in Blizzard's best interest to get these server errors and long queues fixed up in the next week or so because they're going to lose a lot of their players if they don't. That's all I have for you guys today. Just a short Overwatch 2 video, but I want to know from you guys down in the comment section below, have you been playing Overwatch 2? And more importantly, have you been able to get into the servers for Overwatch 2? Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you all so much and I'll see you in the next video.